Happy Friday! Hey everybody, welcome to my live today. Hi Helen, thanks for joining me today. I have so much to do and so much goodness to share. I am about to record five videos. So if you tune in next week, please know that I do change my clothes. Um, but I will look just like this in all of the videos. Um, we're gonna use this transfer and I found this super cute random little wood clippy board. I'll show you in a second. Um, totally at a discount store. Um, Love brings us home and then it has like two hearts and the cute little house heart. So we're gonna use this today. Hi Angelique and Margaret, hello, hello. Um, so might as well get started because I have a little prep work. Um, I'm gonna show you, look how crooked I am. There we go. So I found this board. It has these two little clips. Um, so you can put like a photo or like a little mini um, banner or something super cute on there, which that just gave me the most adorable idea to make a mini banner. How could I do that? Oh my goodness, I bet I could do it. You guys, I just came up with an idea. I love when that happens. I'm gonna make a mini banner. Hey, Gina and Leveda and Victoria. I'm sorry, I'm making all this noise just to get this open. There we go. I have an idea. So maybe we'll try this first. Um, it just needs to be big enough to put these on it. And I have some of this. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, so I just had this idea. So let's work a little backwards. Who's getting ready to leave for a cruise? <laughs> Not me yet. Uh, today I went, got my hair color done, no more gray. Yay. And then I went shopping to get stuff for my next week's videos that I'll be doing for y'all. Um, while I'm on the cruise, I'll be pre-programming videos. Um, and then I, of course, I have to do today's live. So not packed yet, but I have all night. So if I can whip out five videos, get them all uploaded and scheduled, um, life will be good. And if I could do all of that before my husband gets home, that would be the best scenario. Not sure that will happen, but it's all right, it's okay. So I'm thinking if I, like I literally just need this much of this and three little, let me see. I'm kind of excited all of a sudden. Three of these, so let me make a cut like that. I'm gonna make my own little tab things. So this is a pretty cool kind of um, burlap because it's nice and finished off on this edge so if I cut it it won't fray um, so let's do I'm gonna cut it about the size of what these are so let me use that as my guide about the size of this Okay, then I'm gonna kind of make them I'm gonna trim them down so that they're equal to each other. Okay. Then let's see the biggest one. 
I'm gonna cut off the bottom and then I'm gonna fold it in half and do a little like that. Can you see what I made? All right, so then if I do three of those, it's gonna be so cute. Okay. And I think they will fit on there. This one needs a little trim. Actually, I think I this one's a little yucky. Let me cut another one that will not be so yucky. Yucky is not what we want. Oh my goodness, all right. Who's talking to me? You're watching as you drive home from, ten from Florida to Tennessee. Oh, awesome. Hi, Vicki. I think I talked to you. Lisa, hello. Carol, hi. Thanks, Carol. Hi, Vicki. Hi, Rhonda. Oh, East Tennessee, too. Hi, Carly. Oh, thank you. That's what happens when you get to go get your hair done and you look all like, look at me. I do. I look like this every day. If I, I cannot get my hair to match what my, what my girl does. She, she, she fixes me up so nice. Hi, Rebecca, Nancy. So our flight leaves tomorrow at 8 a.m. It's an hour to the airport. We, we board at 7.30. So I figure I wanna get there at six or 6.30. It's a small airport. So I'm probably, we're probably gonna have to leave here at 5, 5.30 ish a.m. So we got to get it all done tonight <laughs> so that we can just get up and go. Thanks, Carly. Vicki. Hi, Vicki. Oh, I said hi to you. Eva. Hello. Hi, George. Hi, Karen. Long time no see. Hi, Sonia. And Dom Marie. Hello. Hello. All right. So that one was yucky. This one is not going to be yucky. I'm going to, I'm going to match this all right so we are gonna need some hot glue today I have decided that might be a little short I probably need to put the little one in the middle because it'll hang down um, so let's just get creative get fancy here plug in my hot glue ay 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 unplug that. I cannot wait for one of the projects that I'm doing. I have it set up behind me. One of the projects I'm doing for next week. So next week's theme is spring and I'm really excited. I have several things where I'm going to show you the spring stuff and then I'm going to put the bundle in my VIP group. So if you aren't inside my VIP group, make sure you type add me in the comments here so I can get you that link. Um, for customers or people who are not designers, basically. So you can't be a designer and then be in um, the VIP group. All right, so what's gonna happen is um, I need to paint this. I'm gonna get all that off of it. And I don't wanna paint it like solid because y'all know my style. Um, um, I'm gonna paint it Oh, I have, I gotta get situated. I'm gonna get my hot glue gun out and we need to put it on the mat and we need to put another stick of hot glue in there. Okay, all right, so we're all set for that because we're gonna hot glue that. So we gotta paint this. So what I have is I have a little glass, a plastic cup with some water in it and I'm going to gray wash this, or should I white wash it? If I'm using, I was gonna gray wash it, but that's before I started using this. This matches that, it should be fine. Gray, do I have anything that has gray and this on it? 
so I know it will be a good color combo. Let's just go for it. Yeah, go for it. Gray or white? Gray or white wash? Gray or white wash? I really kind of want to do the gray. Thank you, Karen. I will try. Hi, Rhonda. Safe travels. Thank you. We will do our best. Oh, thanks, George. Hi, Lori Hughes. Currently making countdown blocks from the kids for our cruise. Oh, awesome. When is your spring break? I'm going to go ahead and do the gray. I'm not going to worry so much about it. Um, I'm going to... I usually like to use a spoon. I forgot to bring a spoon over, so... Um, we're going to use a knife, a plastic knife, which we'll do. Because I kind of like to measure how many dollops I do. I'm just kind of pouring it in there. And then you really have to mix it up a lot. So um, I put like two, shoot, two spoonfuls in here um, of what I would call a spoonful with a knife. So um, we're just going to stir it up. And I think I'm gonna put a little bit more I may be using some of this for some of my other projects too, so that's all right. So this is called Parisian Gray, FYI. So it's a lighter color, kind of like a stone color. It looks kind of like cement, actually. And I'm just mixing it up really well with the water. Oh yay, chocolate mail is always good. I got some today as well. The rest of my house cut out so I can finish packing and shipping those. First we gave up Carly, so is ours. We're not doing a cruise with our kids, but we're going to Florida. And um, we've never taken them to Florida before, so this will be their first time. And we talked about next year in 2021 doing a cruise with them. So I think it will be fun. I am going to grab a paintbrush and I'm going to put some gloves on just because it's easier for me. I have white nails. Let's just, let's just call it what it is. I got to protect them. The guy who did my nails is like, now you need to make sure you be careful. Like don't get makeup on it. Don't get chemicals, like all this stuff. All right, so here we go. I'm just going to dip in here. And I'm going to go over all of it. Okay. It's not a very dark wood. So whatever I get on here, it's going to be light, right? So we'll do some darker things. For the whitewash, I love using these sponges because it picks up the, this color and then you can get into these little crevices. Now it is gonna soak in. This was like a super inexpensive board. Like it's made with like the super cheap soft wood. You know what I'm talking about. Um, Trying to get the string back so I can get these edges. We have never done a Disney cruise, but we thought about that. I know that the one of the cruise lines, um, so way back when my girls were second grade and fourth grade, so what's that, like eight or like eight and nine, maybe there were seven and nine. We took them with us on a Norwegian cruise. It was the Norwegian Epic. And they that cruise ship is decked out in like all Nickelodeon stuff. It was so much fun. They literally had the time of their lives. Um, 
I have never taken the boy. We've never taken the boys, and that was the only cruise we've gone on. But it was it was so much fun, and I I kind of like Norwegian with kids because there's so much less structure. It's kind of like you can eat where you want, when you want. You know, you don't have that set time, and you can just kind of play it by ear. But um. I would try anything. And of course, Disney is going to be like totally in tune with kids. Um, so we will see. We haven't. I have to look into it. Disney World next year. Yeah, so we're so we're going to try to do a few things. Um, we're going to go to Magic Kingdom but I think that's the only Disney park we're gonna do. I'm not sold on needing to do all of it because there's so much more to do in that area. And plus we wanna do a couple day trips to a couple other places. Um, we'll be there, our trip will actually be longer than what we're gonna be there because I was looking up flights and um, Good Lord, the price of flights from Michigan to Florida. Or even if I fly out of Chicago or Detroit, like it doesn't even matter. They're like $500 each. And I'm like, gosh. I hate to like put so much money in there when we don't mind driving. So we talked about it and decided we'll leave a day early, drive to Tennessee which is not a bad trip. Stay the night, let the kids run around, get their energy out, and then um, drive the rest of the way um, on Saturday. And so we'll get there on the same day that we had planned to get there before. And the only thing with driving then is we will leave a day early to do that same two-day trip on the way back. Ah, thank you, Kyle. Yes, I love my hair when Amber does it. Okay, so I think this is pretty good. You can kind of see that it absorbs in a lot. So um, you can go over it depending on how dark you want it. Let's say I only want this top part to be darker. So I'll go over this a like, second time. Um, but I'll leave everything else the way it is and I'll just kind of even that out, get the bubbles out and then the rest will be a little bit lighter. I'm going to go ahead and set this over here so I don't knock it off. I love the color I created. Okay. And this is really, you can now start to see as it dries the grain, which when you're doing a wash, that's exactly what you want. You want to see the grain. Dawn Marie, I love my new nail place. I did find a new one. They were, it was so good. Very reassuring to me that I could find a place. I went on like Yelp and Google and found um, a place that literally had like five stars and everybody raved about it. And it looked good and the selection was good and he totally knew what he was doing. So happy, happy, happy about that. You did the Epic last year, Carly. Isn't it fun for the kids? Like seriously, loved that ship. We did it the year it was brand new. So it was a while ago. Um, but now my boys are a totally different, like I just noticed that there are a few blank spots in here. My boys are a different guy, you know, like it scares me. My boys are way more, let me lean off the railing, kind of a person. My girls definitely did not scare me, but the boys could be, could be a little scary. Um, Jess has, um, I know, Jessica and I, Carol, are twinning with our nails. It was hilarious. She goes, I, Cause at first she was like, I think I'm going to go white. And I'm like, yeah, I'm definitely going to go light. I just, I'm not sure till I get there. So I picked out the white and then I'm like, I need to do gold too. So then she comes back and she's like, I got white and gold. I'm like, oh my gosh, we're so twinning. Yeah. We have the same. 
she's already there and Ken and Sean are already there. I, we don't leave till tomorrow morning because Aaron works, you know, a normal job and can't take, like, we didn't want to waste a whole day of work for him because he's already taking off this vacation plus our spring break. Royal Caribbean. So we did Royal Caribbean two years ago and loved it. Just Aaron and I though, just the two of us. Um, so I feel like it probably would be good with the kids. Oh, okay. All right, that's clearly not dry yet. I'll just get this. Just don't go to the dead heat of summer at Disney. I know, it is, I know. So our um, convention this summer in July is in Orlando. I will not be leaving the building. Um, I don't know, unless I'm in the pool. I Orlando is like a beast in the summer. It is not my friend. And I think I told you guys this story. When I was eight months pregnant, seven and a half to eight months pregnant with Easton, I was in Orlando in July. And like several times I thought I was going to die. And I just like stood in line for the stupid buses and I would get on the bus. Thankfully it was air conditioned. And I'm seriously standing there eight months pregnant, gonna pass out. And people would not like get up for me to sit down and I'm like leaning and it was fine. And I was with friends and none of us were sitting and they were like, are you okay? I'm like, I'm fine. Totally fine. Like I'm a champ. It's fine. But people just, you know, it was, it was, it was awful. I'm like, I hate this place. So this is going to be an adjustment for me to like go and be happy about it. It won't be, you know, a million degrees and humid. Wanting to see the beautiful part of Tennessee. Middle Tennessee. Nashville is flat. Yes, I know. So I've been to Nashville a bunch. But my sister and brother, my brother and sister-in-law used to live in Knoxville. So we've been there quite a few times. And like in the Smokies, is that what it's called? Like the Gatlinburg area, we've done that. Hi, Shalise. I'm, I don't, oh yeah, I got you, I got you, I got, I'm reading it. All right, so this looks good. I'm excited about that. Um, I will take my gloves off because who needs fingerprints, right? Nobody. Um, if you weren't with me yesterday, you know this fingerprint story. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and hot glue this together. Try to spread it out. Ugh, ugh, I'm so, I kind of want to, let me see. Oh, I'm kind of hot gluing it on this little hot mat over here because I know that I need to cut this in half, hold on. Do you guys have that problem when you put your glue stick in, it's like too big to use your thumb to press it down? I guess, I don't, I don't know a trick. I'm just hot mess express over here. So I'm gonna hot glue this string down. And hopefully it will be amazing and it will work and all of my dreams will come true right here in this magic moment of me being creative that's a lot of pressure lots of pressure okay <gasps> don't burn me Okay, sorry. I'm I'm doing this. I know it's like off camera, but I don't have that hot pad thing on camera. I'm just making a bead of 
glue and then I'm setting the string on it. I can set it, I can show you now. So this is what I have. Just need it to like totally dry. Make sure it's all nice and in there. Um, I want to say that like there are 50-ish earners, maybe 60, 50-ish earners, and then we each, like some of us will be bringing spouses because you could have earned it for one person or just, or you could have earned it for um, two people. I earned it for two but some people may have only earned it for one, so maybe only one person is going, and then they're, fr you know, like, we're all friends, so it does. it's not like you're going by yourself. Or you pay for the other person to go. So I wanna say around that many people. Um, yeah, and then, so we may have like 100-ish, 120-ish people all together, including spouses going on an 11 day cruise to Alaska in August. Oh, awesome. I would love to do an Alaskan cruise. I will just not get off the boat. I'm afraid of bears and big animals and fish and ants. I mean, we all know I'm a baby. Hey, Jane. Hello, hello. Warm up the tip of the glue stick with the hot part of the... <gasps> Kyle, you're a genius. Yes. Cool in Florida right now. Cold front has come through. Oh, well, it better warm up by April. I'm just telling you. I'm just warning you. Okay. Now, um, for the colors on here... I'm kind of going with the, my, my actual intention was to try to create the juniper color with the colors I was using yesterday. Um, but I'm thinking if I use the hearts, I may just do little heart. No, I can't do the house there. Maybe I'll just do little heart, big heart, big heart. And maybe we can um, do the Maybe I won't use the house. I'm not even sure. But I'm thinking of doing, should I try out our new pink grapefruit? What do y'all think? Where did that go? Oh, here it is. Should I try out our new pink grapefruit? I think it'll kind of look cool. I'm gonna do, um, I'm going to do Storm. At first I thought I would do blues, but I didn't plan to do the hearts. And I kind of feel like hearts should be in a pinky color, not red for goodness sakes. Camera or phone. So I, I use two phones. I actually use an iPod touch, a phone and an iPad to get my cameras and to run my program. And it's called Switcher Studios. Switcher Studio, um, but there are some, it's a paid program. You can get two weeks free. If you message me, I'll give you the link. Hey, Heather. That's so funny. Two days in a row, lucky you. I'm trying to figure out what color I wanna do. I think I'm gonna do this pink lemon, pink grapefruit. So the other cruise that I want to go on is Mediterranean. I've never been across the ocean. Never. So I think that would be amazing. Trip of a lifetime. Because I don't, I don't know that I would do well traveling abroad. I'm so just, I like my comforts of the U.S., but I want to do it. I want to see old things. Like I want to do, honestly, Italy and Greece, you know, 
that's what I want to do. Um, I definitely would love to go to France, um, but Italy and Greece are my main, you know, love. That's what I want so badly. Okay. Okay, here we go. This is like um, thick, but it's going to be smooth. I can already tell from stirring it. We're gonna do hearts on here. Got this beautiful pink grapefruit color. It's pretty, 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 pretty. Pretty, pretty, please. I was listening to a little pink today. Hi, Leona. Hello, Jill. Howdy, howdy. Okay. Now this is striped, so hopefully it comes out. You know, when you're when you're chalking on fabric, or especially burlap, you never kind of know what to expect. Oh, that one turned out because it's like so holy. You know, you just, you just never know. And you can go over it a few times. Just press so that you're getting it through the screen. Be intentional with your pressing. There, that's cute. All right. I'm not sure if I will use these hearts again, but I'm gonna set them in the water anyway. So when this dries, actually I probably could pop it up here now. I'm just gonna give it a little angle. There we go. Cute, how cute. Um, should I go ahead and do the words in that same color so that it kind of coordinates? I kind of think I should. Oh, Greece is totally a dream trip. Agree, agree. You went to Singapore. Um, I don't think, I don't think I could. <laughs> I don't know about Asia. It's a whole thing with me. I'm just not sure if I could handle being so far away and so different. I love to hear about tri trips, but I don't know if I could. Mexican Riviera is always fun. Hi, Shelly. Hi, Debbie. So, of course, they don't pay for our drink plan, only if we go to an all-inclusive resort. But um, the funny thing about cruise lines and free cruises that we don't book ourselves, the drink plan is extremely expensive. So you have to pay like retail price for it. You don't get to use any of their sales. When I was much younger, cruising was the way to go, my friends. I went seven cruises. Yeah, oh, I loved, I like cruising. They take care of everything except for any drink packages or um, food packages. Like they take care of all of our tips you know, and all the gratuity that you have to pay, um, all of our transfers, our flights, our transfers, all of that stuff. So I probably should do a little waxing on here. So let's do that. I don't know why my phone is out. Oh, told like no it's um it, those are good questions because you hear probably about people earning trips and you wonder like what does it include we so we've done cruises um and that's how that it works like you can totally go on a free trip if you drink like the free drinks the free water and um 
will always eat at the free restaurants and don't do anything extra. There is one excursion, like we only booked one excursion. Um, and of course that we pay for ourselves. And I'm trying to think what else could there possibly be? Oh, we have done all-inclusive resorts, and of course, everything is, like, that is a free trip because you're not paying for anything except maybe the tipping from your taxi, you know, or the tipping because it's a little different. Um, okay. Got that done. Okay. Now, but so this Fiji trip that I'm trying to earn right now, that is not all inclusive and it's not a cruise. So we are in it. We will be paying for our food, our like everything. So um, basically they're getting us there and they're accommodating us, but we are paying for our food and excursions and stuff. All right. So I'm fuzzing the transfer on my fuzzing cloth. Julie Fox, I have the exact same thing for my trip. Great minds. Here's the thing. It was so expensive to do the drink package for alcohol that there is no way I would drink enough to cover it. And I don't even think my husband would drink enough. So we're doing the, um, like you can bring two bottles of wine on per person. So I've got my two bottles of wine. Hi, Cassie. Oh, hi, Karina and Jenny and Caitlin. How's it going, ladies? Cassie, Cassie. Hope y'all are um, doing well and being smart and safe and all of those things that kids need to be doing. Um, so I'm trying to figure out, I need to get this straight. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and do this color. Do you guys agree? So I just wanna tell you, the drink package for our trip is $800 plus tax per person we have two people, you can't just do one person. And so it is like over $1,700. There's no way. We have gone on cruises and not had the drink package and our bill was like $300, $350. There is no way we're gonna spend $1,700 on drinks, alcohol, you know, whatever. So yeah. It's, it's all good. So I'm bringing my wine. Oh, shoot. This is not sticking. Hold on. <gasps> oh, please, dear God, let this work. I think when I wax it with this wax, it's not as... It's... Shoot! Okay. I'm going to hold it tight. I'm so scared. I might, so I went over a seam here, so there's a chance that I may have to go back over that. Um, oh, it's a little bit light. Not in person, let me hold it up. It's actually, it's actually good in person, but when I have it this far away from you, it's hard to see. I could go over it with a darker color and do like a offset. What do you think of that? Let me dry it and see. 
No, it would never be. It would absolutely never be enough to make it worthwhile. We like normally they have sales right now. Like if we booked a cruise, you get it for free. So um, it's because we were booked by a, a travel agent and it's um, it was a free trip for us. So they literally can charge that and people will be like, oh, well, it was a free trip. So I can splurge on that. It's not worth it. You could drink like, not that I would, but you could drink five or six drinks every night and still not pay that much every day and still not pay that much. So you think you would leave it and not put anything darker over it? I'm trying to, let me, let me wash this. I don't know. I kind of, it, since it dried, I feel like it's a little darker. It kind of looks good. Just like that. If I did anything, I would probably do like a gray or a, yeah, I would probably do darker, but um, leave it. Yeah, I actually think I'm going to leave it. I like this color too. You guys like that? The pink, pink, um, pink grapefruit. I don't know why I can't think. Yeah, it got darker when it dried. So yeah, it looks really good. So let me show you. Um just with me, how it looks. So remember it started out this color, right? And I just gray washed it. So it kind of resembles a barn wood color. And then I made, I was gonna like put like a little photo up here, but then decided to do that. So I really like the little thing and it's cute, yay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Lisa. Didn't even see you pop on. Someone else. I need to know how to say your name. I can't. Okay. So I'm going to like say your name. No. So Miss McCracken, how do you say your name? Is it Janella or something else? You tell me if I said that right. Cause I want to say hi to you, but I didn't know how to say your name. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. If you guys um, have any, absolutely any curiosity about becoming a designer, we are independent consultants with Chalk Couture and um, it's super fun, very easy to um, create, obviously. You don't have to be actually creative because the transfers do the work for you, so that's awesome. But if you're interested, wanna know, you know uh, the details, Type team in the comments and I will give you a link to join my opportunity group where you can watch a video. It's no pressure. I do not like hound you. Like I'm super not pressury about the business. Um, so just check it out. There's lots of information in there and you probably are wondering like how much can you make or what's the discount or how much does it cost to start? All those questions are answered in there. Type team in the comments and I'll get you that link and you can join. Um, we only have two days left to grab the awesome um, Club Couture from this month. If you are like, what's Club Couture? It is our subscription program where when you subscribe, you become a preferred customer. Right now, um, the preferred customers are getting a special sale on chalk paste. All of the containers of chalk paste are on sale for 20% off, but only if you're a preferred customer. If you type team in the mm, club, if you type club in the comments, I will get you a link that will tell you all about what our club is. It's a subscription for $19.99 a month and you get a project every month. So you're gonna get three paste, pack, three paste packets, different colors, plus a transfer to do multiple projects every month. You don't pay shipping. It's $19.99 plus tax and that's it. 
Um, so if you type club, we'll get you that information. And once you join, you can go right back and order your chalks and get them at the discounted price. But there's only two days left. It ends at midnight on February 29th. So let me know. Um, type in the comments whether you need the club information or the VIP group information or um, team information. You guys have a great rest of your Friday, an amazing weekend. I will be around. I'll be posting and, of course, doing some of that stuff. But next week, if I look just like this um, every day, it's because I'm recording all my videos next. <laughs> so um, I can't wait for you to watch. We're doing spring theme. And uh, that's all. That's all I have to say. Vanilla with a G. Ganella. Oh, Ganella. Got it. I wasn't sure if it was a hard G. Ganella. Very, very cool. Glad I know now. Mama Disney. Cute project. Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, happy sailing. Thank you. I can't wait. Yay. I will. We will. Definitely some R and R. Gloria. Hi. All right, I'm about to head out. Where is the surface from? A very discounted store that's blue and has like yellow things and starts with a W. I had to run there to get magnets because I'm using those on some of my spring projects. And um, I went down the little crafty aisle and found all kinds of stuff. So thank you, Kyle. Thank you, thank you. I am gonna be posting pictures. So I'm working my Instagram, right? So I'll be posting on Instagram and it'll share to Facebook. And so you'll see some photos that way. And then of course on my personal profile, which is totally public so y'all can see it anyway. Even if you're not my friend, it'll be all right. Okay, you guys have a great weekend and I will um, talk to you soon. Bye guys.